right, so here he is, the former two-time UFC light heavyweight title challenger, Alexander Gustafson. There was some retirement talk a few years ago, but he seems to have his head screwed on right now. Came back with that huge knockout of Glover Teixeira not all that long ago that many argue was the best performance of his UFC career. Yes, and I'm glad that Alexander Gustafson is still here. Yeah. Because why would you leave when you still are so valuable to everything that happens in the UFC light heavyweight division? A very, very skilled striker, underrated wrestling, has scored takedowns on some of the best wrestlers the UFC light heavyweight division has ever seen. Tall, big, great cardio, a fantastic fighter is Alexander Gustafson. And he's going to hang around at least long enough to realize a third crack at that elusive UFC light heavyweight title. All right, so here he is, one of the better offensive takedown guys we have in the UFC DC. And if anyone is well equipped to speak to this, it is you. The opponent knows what's coming, at least to this point in the UFC, no one's been able to stop. He just has to keep him away. Because the moment this guy gets close enough to either grab a leg or make body contact, right. now you're in trouble. He has a knowledge and an understanding of position from a lifetime of just all grappling, judo, wrestling, uh, Sample. He does it all, and he has just so many ways to get you to the floor. This guy once told me that if he can get your leg, he's going to finish. Right. Because he's going to give you so many things to think about, you will not be able to process and keep up with him, and eventually you're on the mat. It's unbelievable to watch him apply that knowledge to the mixed martial arts fight. And as the wrestlers say, this is not a guy you want anywhere near your bracket. No, you don't want him in the bracket. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena, in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. It's who you first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 18 wins, seven losses. He stands six feet five inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting out of Stockholm, Sweden, Alexander the Molar Gustafsson. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. The fighters touch gloves. Ready. All right, so the fight is now underway on one side. We have a fighter who does everything well. Taking on a true grappler on the other side. It's going to be interesting to see how long he can keep it up with. I mean, Damian Maya may be the most specialist type of grappler in the U.S. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Just missed with the left there. with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. He's got to be careful dipping his head when he's throwing that jab. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Gustafson. 
Anderson gets stung by that leg kick. Clean left punch followed by the right. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. That's a big strike right there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. He's his leg up. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate. A lot of activity in the hands look phenomenal. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Alexander Gustafson. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Big ball punch land. Now he gets back to range. Is that right hand land? Oh, vintage stuff there. Nice combination of strikes by Alexander Gustafson. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. And he's looking for that left hand just missed. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Oh, Superman punch is good. You can tell he's been working on that. Throwing that jab now again. The fighter evades. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Nice job with that follow-up shot as well. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Big punch man over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Big body kick. Oh, the difference in the striking is crazy. Can't take many of those, you better check. Straight right hand counter. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Well, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Gustin. Oh, that's a nice strike. And in terms of the pressure and the pace, there just aren't a lot of 205 pounders in the world that are going to be able to compete with this guy. Big kick land. Final minute of round one. Back to the jab now, no good. And that left hook landed on the button. Oh, big shot land. Right lands. Shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Oh, he might be out. He's mixing up his target. He's throwing kicks. He's throwing punches. Oh, big left. Good series of punches by him there. He has been busy throughout. He's doing a great job with the hands. He looks like a professional boxer out there. Tags him with the left. Nice loop and punch. Some nice back and forth action here. Take a seat. Let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went head hunting, landed, nearly got the finish too. A lot of coaches tell you don't head hunt. In this case, he's been headhunting, and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Straight right hand now just misses. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Gustafson. And he landed the right hand there. Good defense. 
defense to block the strike coming back. Whiffs on the straight right hand. Powerful leg kick lands. Andy lands the knee to the body now. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Gustafson gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Blocks the shot. Well, Gustafson's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. All right, so he continues to use his jab effectively here, DC. He gets that hand to the target pretty quickly. I mean, just right away, blasting the jab after jab after jab. He is a phenomenal boxer with a vast understanding of fighting behind that educated jab. Hands high, hands high. There's the leg kick. That one checked by Alexander Gustafson. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great timing to land that punch. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Right hand count. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. Just misses there with the left. Nice punch land over the top. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such a tough to be on the feet right now. Well, he's up, but he is hurting for certain. The finish could come at any time. Well, not much of a setup there. Misses with the left. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. And now he lands a combination. Try to establish that jab. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. It's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice its size. This guy today is looking at focus miss in his opponent. All right, so a nice job there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Oh, big punch lands. All right, so there he goes, continuing to land that jab. When they put this highlight together, it's just going to be one head snapping back. It's going to be boxers going back and watching this guy and going, wow, this is what a jab is supposed to look like. Counters with a left punch. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Let's get going now. Ten seconds remain in round two. Hands higher, hands higher. Oh, that's the end of round number two. All right, so the round mercifully comes to an end, and how about the cut on his lip? Really, really bad. If that thing gets any worse, they're going to certainly have to stop this fight. The doctor looks like he's already going to be called in here. All right, so a huge round for him there. That head kick probably would have had me out for good. The guy survives to see another round. Yeah, but he'll go back to that. It landed so perfectly. He set it up great. He did a great job of mixing up the target early, going up high, and getting the desired result.
Third round underway. Look at him with his history for that kick. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Punch over the top. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Straight right is there. Just misses with that one. His head's still attached to his body. The last time I saw an uppercut like that, it was Overeem versus Ngannou. And you know, they still have it from Alistair over his head. Ooh, head kick lands from hurt. Straight punch lands. Ooh. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Oh! He was hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. So he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Gets up again here, but hurt him. Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and marched right through it to get the knockout. <laughs> Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 36 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Alexander the Mauler Gustafsson. And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoy the birth of your kids, right? But yeah. you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done. And he should be very proud of the work he and his coaches got done tonight.